when God asked Adam and Eve, who told you you were naked? The only correct answer for that would be Satan. So, as you know, Satan had the iniquity in him and he fell. And because he fell and iniquity was found in him, we now live in a sin matrix. And, and, and... Create a living organism. This sin matrix is because of Satan, okay? So when Satan fell, he was there before Adam was made on earth, okay? And, uh... What happened is their eyes were opened. Their eyes were opened to the iniquity that they ate of from Satan. As you know, the tree of knowledge of good and evil was in the Garden of Eden. So I want to show you how Satan is trying to, is making his image to the beast. All right. He is, <coughs> well, God is putting a curse on people who do not abide in Jesus Christ's righteousness. And this has a lot to do with Satan, okay? As you know, Satan cannot do anything if God doesn't allow it. So Satan is a tool for God. <coughs> As you know, there are vessels of mercy and there are vessels of wrath, okay? Some of us are preordained to heaven, some of us aren't. Some of us are preordained. We're all preordained, okay? But here's the thing. I'm gonna show you some artwork that the college students at the University of Iowa are doing downtown in the Ped Mall and what they are is they're on these benches where people sit and um, we all know that every single thing in this world has a purpose okay God shows us his signs of things to come in everything God shows us his signs of things to come in everything. You gotta keep your eyes open. So I'm gonna come back here in a little bit. I'm still walking down down and I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about. And it's freaking, it's intense, all right? It's intense. So uh, just beware that it's gonna be intense. My calculations are correct. When this baby hits 88 miles per hour, you're gonna see some serious shit.
tell you! 88 miles per hour! The thermal displacement occurred exactly 120 a.m. in zero seconds! Ah, Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, Doc, you disintegrated Einstein! Calm down, Marty, I didn't disintegrate anything! Um, if you don't realize who the Jesuits are, they are the Revived Knights Templar. In olden times, you would, if you get on the internet and you research what the Knights Templars were after, it goes back to Solomon and his information and his uh, commanding of uh, spirits and stuff like that. It goes back to Mount Hermon and how the angels fell on Mount Hermon at a 33rd degree parallel. And um, there's a lot of information in, 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 the, in the technology that you are able to reach today. Um, I suggest you do it. But anyway, back to the Knights nice Templar. Did you ever hear about how they wanted to find the Holy Grail? What if I told you that the Knights Templar served Satan? In the beginning they were serving God, but they fell from their ways. And they started serving Satan. What they want is the Aether. Nikola Tesla has information on the Aether. Electromagnetic fields, our brains are electromagnetically connected to each other. Um, people can make other people do certain things. Um, the Aether is the Holy Grail, if you think about it. So, check that out, too. And, uh, they have gotten it. They have tapped into the matrix of the sin system, the iniquity that we all live in, thanks to Satan. But yeah, you guys have a good day, and, and uh, enjoy your day, enjoy your coffee, enjoy your food, because um, vanity is everywhere, and everything underneath the sun and um, enjoy your food. Just give thanks for everything. And uh, everything will play its course. You can believe that. Okay, this is the artwork that the University of Iowa students are doing. As you can see here, we have the dual symbolism right next to the DNA. And then we have the female dual symbolism next to the DNA. Another dual symbolism. The vaccines. More dual symbolism. And alchemy. So what exactly do you think the times are we are in? This video that you're watching was uploaded seven years ago. And what they painted on that stool was done it was done six or seven years ago. Way before all the COVID and graphene and stuff that everybody's talking about. Eighty eight.
Jesus Christ, Doc, you disintegrated Einstein. Calm down, Marty, I didn't disintegrate anything. 